Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to add Xbox Game Pass game from Xbox app to Steam. Now for this, uh, this is just an example. So for example, this is the game, whichever game you want to add, you can select that game and then you can make a right click on that game or and then click on manage or you can click on these three dots over here and then click on manage and then you can go to files and go to the game installation folder. So in my case, this is the game. So whichever game you want to add, open that game folder, open content folder and over here you will see the game exe file. For example, for this game, this is the exe file. Uh, Gears of War Reloaded, this is the exe file. And you might also see game launch helper. This is also a exe file. And if you find multiple folders, you can open each folder and you can find the game exe file. So in this case, binary is x64. Here also I can find the game exe file. Now there are so many exe files. Now to, for example, if you want to add this exe file, so whichever exe file you want to add, you can just open that folder and at the top you will see the location. So this is the location. You can copy this location and then go to Steam. Now click on add a game and then click on add a non Steam game. And then over here you can select any random application. For example, I will select battle.net. This you can select any random application and then click on add selected program. And once that application is added, make a right click on that application and then go to properties and then go to the target option over here in this in this target we will just copy this location copy it and then inside within the inverted comma do not remove the inverted commas we will paste the location so this is the location in my case and the, this is the game exe file so we will just make a right click and then we can copy this we will just copy this ex uh, like name of this exe file the game exe file and then we will after uh, after the path you have to put a backward slash over here and then you can paste the exe file name over here so in this case it was g o w d e slash win g d k now once you add it you can remove this if you want and then the name of the application you can rename it for example in my case gears of war reloaded so you can write down the name of the game if you want to change the icon also you can just if you have any icon um, you can just select any icon this is just an example i have selected this icon you can even change the icon and then you can close this go back to steam here you can see the game over here. If you want to cha change the uh, custom background, you can even uh, change the custom background. If you want. Now you can click on play over here. And you should be, uh, this is the game error. This is not the Steam error, but just ignore this. And here you can see the game is launching. Now, if you don't find the game exe file, if you face any problem, like if you have added the game exe file to Steam, but still the game is not launching from here. In that case, you can click on add a game, add a non Steam game. And then you can select any random application. For example, I have selected this. Now, if you if the game exe file is not working in that case, uh, when you open this actually, uh, if you have it in C drive, it, it is under Xbox Xbox game. Now over here you can open the game folder, content folder. And over here you will see this game launcher helper. For every game I think you will find game launcher uh, launch helper. So you can copy this location. And then you can just make a right click on the app which we which you have added now go to properties inside the inverted comma you can paste the location and yeah paste the location and then the game exe file is game launch helper so you can rename copy this 
and then you can go and give a okay. backward slash put the exe name over here and then if you want you can remove this and you can just name it and then close this if you want to change the icon you can change the icon uh, let me close this game for now and once it is added i again i have name this gears of war uh, now you can click on play and this will also launch the game click on yes to allow and here you can see the game is launching so this is how you can add the xbox game pass game to steam so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel